Kim here at the snowiest college in America. And if I'm at the snowiest college in America, I'm going to work with the coldest material you can find in a chemistry lab, and that's liquid nitrogen. Where am I? I'm at Michigan Tech with a Michigan Tech student, Riley. Hi. And Riley, how cold is liquid nitrogen? Colder than the coldest day in the middle of winter. <laughs> but how cold is liquid nitrogen? About negative 196 degrees Celsius. Negative 196 degrees Celsius? That is incredibly cold. Well, if we have this cold liquid nitrogen, what could we do with it? Well, how about let's put some pasties in the liquid nitrogen. What do you think? Do you like pasties? That was like my first meal as I moved in and that was my dinner. The my staple at Michigan Tech, right? The Uper pasty in the Upper Peninsula of Michigan. Well, let's, let's, why not, put it in liquid nitrogen and okay. see what happens. First time, never did this. I'm gonna use some tongs to put it in. And I see you have a hammer there, Riley. Oh, so yes. what do you think? Oh, we have to pull it out and smash it. Bye, Pasty. Like we're cooking pasties <laughs> right here. Now this that you're seeing right here, Riley, uh -huh. that's actually not smoke. That's fog. And that is because of the water in the atmosphere that is cooling down from that liquid nitrogen, right? Yeah. You see how it just falls down? It's a great material for maybe a little smoky Halloween effect. But a lot of people use carbon, like solid carbon dioxide, right, dry ice? Yeah. But this is also really cool. Well, what do you think? Is it done cooking? Still bubbling, but... Still bubbling. First time ever pulling a pasty out of liquid nitrogen. I'm more excited than I can contain. Oh my gosh. Oh my God. It feels like a brick. That is a liquid nitrogen pasty that I'm going to set on the table. I have my safety oh. equipment. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. <laughs> Here we go, one more. I think the miners back in the day when pasties first came about would absolutely love this experiment. What do you think? Oh yeah, I know I did. Cheers.